Rockstar Game Capture is the easiest way to capture, edit, and share your PS3 or Xbox 360 gameplay. I'm going to take you through how easy it is to get up and running with your PlayStation 3. Before we get started, let's run through the hardware and cables that come in the box. You have the Game Capture device, one set of component video cables, one set of RCA audio cables, and a USB cable. The Game Capture device sits in between your TV and your game console, essentially acting as a pass-through. Be sure that your console is powered off when plugging everything in. Let's first start with connecting the Game Capture device to your TV with the component video and RCA cables that are provided. Next, you will connect the Game Capture device to your game console. Keep in mind, if you are currently running HDMI or composite, you will need to provide the PS3 component AV cable. Now that you have the Game Capture device plugged into both the TV and the game console, you'll now need to connect the Game Capture device to your PC using the provided USB cable. If you were running your PS3 with an HDMI cable previously, you will need to adjust the display settings on your console to accept the new component AV cable that you're using to now connect to your game capture device. I'll run through those steps. It's quick and easy. Go to your display settings and video output settings. Switch to component D terminal option and confirm the change. You will now need to change your input on your TV to component. Be sure that the 1080p box is unchecked since it's not supported and check the resolutions supported by your TV and confirm the change. Now select the audio output settings. Change audio to audio input connector and confirm that change. Now that all the hardware is connected, you will need to install the software that is provided. Once installed, Roxu Game Capture will put an icon on your desktop. To start capturing, launch the application and then click the large capture button. This will take you to the capture application of the product. It's here where you can set a number of options if you like, such as output format, capture length, and file naming. You should also notice at this time that you are now seeing your PS3 content coming through the preview window. You're now all set. When you are ready to start capturing, just hit the start capture button and you'll see that the button goes red when it's recording. When you want to stop recording, just hit the button again and it will return to its